it's just a beautiful campus, you know, coming by and, you know, seeing all this stuff and like, I got to see Frog Baby, that was one of my cool things when I came here. Uh, you know, everybody kisses it when they graduate and stuff, so it's just like little stuff like that, it's like tradition uh, wise, um, you know. Seeing uh, stuff like that, it's kind of cool because like that's where I came from, like a little town, it's like a bunch of tradition and stuff. Um, when I was younger, I kind of, kind of wasn't like the most athletic kid, but uh, you know, I, uh, my dad and parents kind of, you know, got me into it, and uh, you know, ever since I touched the ball when I was younger, it's kind of, you know, just stuck with me, and uh, you know, I've been with it ever since. You know, uh, I actually had an injury my junior year. Like right before the season, uh, I had a bad hamstring injury and I hurt my foot as well too. It took it a hard, like a hard effect on me because it was kind of, I had it like during the summer and I thought I was going to be okay and ready to roll. I had to, you know, they told me it's like, you know, you're not ready. And uh, sitting there on the sideline and watching the team, you know, not, they had everything there and like a bunch of young guys are in and you just couldn't like go out there and be out there with them to help them out and stuff. That kind of hurt me a little bit, you know, and uh, we started off like 0-4, and 0-3, and, and we were losing by like a touchdown each game. And so that was kind of like so, super hard for me. But, you know, luckily I got to come back and uh, play and uh, we went to the state championship, but unfortunately we ended up losing, you know, so, but I had all kinds of injuries and stuff, so. Some of those big schools that kind of, you know, just gave up on me, but uh, Ball State offered me, like, I would say even before the injury and everything, and they found out about the injury and they were like, you know, just get healthy, we still want you. So they kind of, they kind of, you know, stuck with me and, you know, I wanted to, you know, come to somebody, um, like come to a school that, you know, cared for me and really liked me. And so, you know, I knew Ball State, uh, you know, they, even though they stuck with me through a bad injury, and they like to win too, you know, coming off the MAC championship. You know, I knew that could be a school that, you know, you could, uh, you know, do something. Coming here to Ball State as well with uh, Coach New, he has a bunch of tradition stuff too. So that kind of, you know, helped me like transition over, you know, and not like be out of the ordinary and stuff like that. So. Parson uh, does a good job, man. He grinds out tough yards when it's time to grind out some tough yards, and he's been able to break through um, and get some big chunk gains as well. And so uh, it's good. It's you know his his, his confidence and uh, his transition to college football has been very positive, and we just got to continue uh, to keep uh, you know, keep letting that grow and, and uh, continue to get him more and more involved. I told the team, uh, I was like, you know, I wanted to help out any way I could, whether it's a scout team or anything like that. But uh, uh, being able to come out and, you know, play, actually get my first touchdown of the first game. Went under center, hands this one off, out of the backfield, Carson Steele, burst of speed into the end zone, touchdown for Mr. Indiana football. Welcome to Muncie, Carson Steele. You know, it's an amazing feeling, um, you know, and all the media and stuff recognition. You know, you kind of just got to like humble yourself down a little and uh, try not to think about all that stuff. You know, put the team over yourself. And, uh, you know, that's definitely helped me, you know, be able to play uh, and, uh, you know, try to figure things out here and there. Big back Carson Steele. He splits the pocket, gets forward and into the end zone. Carson Steele, the freshman. The give is to Carson Steele and he plows his way through for a Ball State touchdown. Oh, look at Carson Steele. Stays on his feet. Touchdown, Cardinals. His work ethic is what stood out. His strength is what stood out. Uh, he put it out there on the practice field each and every day, and uh, that's what we've been able to see so far. He's going to continue to to get the ball more and more if he, uh, you know, because he continues to keep practicing at a high level and and uh, needs to earn those reps.